Okay, this is going to sound mad, but there is something I've been wanting to do for ages. I want to create a time lapse of a leech feeding on my blood. Oh my gosh, oh my god, this is <laughs> These are the suckers. There are around 650 species of leech in the world, but this is the European medicinal leech, the Hirudo medicinalis and it's been used in medicine since 1600 BC and is still in use today for reconstructive surgery. Joe's been helping us make Earth Unplugged videos and he's very kindly agreed to give me some moral support on this one. So, oh, it's swimming. Did you see that? Here you go, Joe. You take five <laughs> and I'll take five. Are you scared? A little bit. I'm really nervous. <laughs> oh my goodness. God, this is weird. Ooh. Are you ready? No, but do it. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, this is weird. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, this is so bizarre. Here we go, number two. Are you ready? No. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> it's stinging. Ah. How is that not stinging you? Okay, the time lapse has now started. So here we have one of the leeches out of the water. It has a sucker at both ends, which they use during locomotion to create a kind of looping motion, but only one of the ends bites. Their mouth contains three jaws in a Y-like formation and they have around 300 teeth. They have five pairs of eyes, 18 testicles and two ovaries. Leeches are hermaphrodites. Now they're actually only taking about 10 to 15 mil of blood each, which might not sound a lot, but that is 10 times their own weight. And it's enough to feed them for a year. They produce a peptide called hyrudin, which stops my blood coagulating. It's so effective that even after they drop off, it's likely that I'll continue to bleed for up to 10 hours. Wow, these are so much bigger. After feeding for a full 45 minutes, they're safe and full of tasty blood. I hope you enjoyed watching this. Please share this with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to Earth Unplugged. Hopefully with the time lapse, we'll be able to see uh, exactly what happens once he starts decomposing. Yeah, it should be really revealing. Pretty much good to go. Today on Slow Mo, we're filming one of the oldest predators in the world, crocodiles. <laughs>